Hello everyone, welcome back to Plask on Plastics. My name is Tristan and today we're going to be talking about polyester. So what is polyester? Polyester is a man-made fabric made out of plastic. Plastic that generally makes polyester is PET or number one plastic, which is polyethylene terephthalate. This is the same plastic that is used for plastic bottles for soda, which is why some garments and polyester clothing is actually made from recycled plastic. Polyester does have many benefits. It lasts long, it's very durable, and it also has sweat wicking capabilities. Because it doesn't grab onto your water and sweat like cotton would, there's little pores, um, it can wick water away from your body very well. This makes it a good base layer for areas like for example if it's super cold out and you're hiking where you don't want that water to be touching your skin it actually makes a very good base layer to remove that water so to make polyester it can be made out of recycled or virgin material um, either way it's generally pet they ha you have pet pellets which is plastic pellets and they get run into a machine to turn into basically long strings this is using uh, ex extrusion molding if you want to look at the types of plastic molding check the video in the description below, the six different types of plastic molding. But for this purposes, we're using extrusion molding and turning that plastic into long, long strings. These strings are then broken down and separated and fluffed to make little, little hairs almost, little threads. And this threads are then wound up to make longer threads, which is used for the clothing at the end. Now, polyester clothing is a huge contributor to microplastics. Because the plastics are wound into such thin threads, they're already microplastics. So every time you wash your garments in the washing machine, threads and microplastics are released back into the water. In fact, because of these little microplastics simply washing away in the washing machine, 500,000 tons of plastic is actually flushed into the waterways. This is equivalent to about 50 billion plastic bottles each year, just in clothing microplastics. And that's not even the worst of the problem. 85% of clothing that is produced each year actually ends up in the dump. This is because things that people return often have trouble selling, end up in the dump. Uh, clothing manufacturers overproduce clothes and it ends up in the dump or fabric uh, that is used to make clothes also ends up in the trash. Also, clothing that you might buy and wear for one or two times, uh, although even though you might donate it to a thrift store, at the end of the day, it usually makes its way again to the dump. So the one good thing with polyester is because it does last a long time, if you buy a high quality garment for yourself, it will last and be durable. But you just need to make sure that before you buy any garments or clothing, it's something that you like and something that you wanna wear for a while. Otherwise, it does contribute to the problem of plastic waste from the fast fashion industry. I hope you enjoyed this video and it gave you an understanding of what polyester is, where it's used and the environmental effects of it please consider subscribing, liking, or leaving a comment down below. Thank you.